as a, a gospel artist representing Teso. I'm called John Francis Angiro, but uh, I'm not well convinced with uh, the meeting. Actually, I call it a press conference that we had with the is it Huma Kuma? In fact, it is a little confusing. These guys have talked to us ever since we arrived. We have not get, gotten uh, any clarification about uh, the agenda. In fact, we have had a meeting, the worst of all meetings in Teso, a meeting without the agenda. Moreover, with the big artists, big icons in Teso. In fact, we represent Eastern Uganda. So I am not well convinced. It's like these guys. Maybe there is something fishy, because if someone comes to your home, at least as a visitor, someone must tell you a reason as to why he or she has come to your home after introducing himself. In fact, even the introduction, we had it after breakfast. So what was your, your expectation? My expectation? Okay, I expected to have come here first to meet uh, the representatives of the association. They call it UMA. I got the president who is... Uh, this, uh, this lady here is Cindy Sanyo, my fellow artist, and then DJ Michael, who has been one of the artists I have loved for long. I expected sense, but instead I have only gotten uh, a, a disappointment. In fact, we are looking so frustrated. There is even no hope of getting any sitting allowance. Remember, we, we traveled here. We spent transport. We spent the whole day here. We spent a lot. It has costed us a lot. Me, I traveled from Katakui. Cat City. Now coming here, you waste the whole day and you go back home with nothing. We have families. We are responsible people. If the government really wants to come in to support us, please, it must be on a clear protocol. Not just calling someone. In fact, I received a message at night at around uh, at around around 2 around 2 a.m. I only received the SMS from my fellow artist I thought it was comedy. Of course, you know, this is a, a, a month of April. Uh, I remember on first, very many people spoke a lot of lies. And when, at first, I doubted it because I knew it was maybe for fun or comedy. But the way these guys really are, um, are making the program to go, it's not really satisfactory. We are not benefiting. Uh, that uh, that uh, that has leaders that have been elected democratically, but of course you know sometimes the democracy in Uganda is virtual democracy. In most cases, it is not real. Thank you, thank you for your time. Yeah. Was it worth your time? Not really. Let me first start by congratulating the people who invited me. I'm really so grateful that I came. They also came. We're here, we're here so early. But uh, what we expected is what, what we have got on the ground. Yes. What did you expect? So many things. Uma, if it is said to be the body uniting all the artists in the country, you mean, you know, understand the country. Yes, yes. We wanted to know how would we feature in. Are, they, are we covered as a region, Teso region? Are we covered other than registering us to join the association? How do we come? How do we feature? How do we benefit from the association? Because we had a lot of issues of money being eaten, left and right, president giving money, the other one giving money, but there are no clear, clear accountabilities about such monies. And two, as I, I emphasize that how are we brought in as a region? What is going to be a clear, transparent, and a structured flow of information? For us who are down here on the ground, you see the distance between here and Kampala is too big. So by the time we get communication or we get to hear anything, to get to know anything that has transpired in the association, we, we need to get people who are linked hmm, at the various levels. You get it. Who will always convey, who will feed us with the right information? Other than coming here to register us, then at the end of the day, they come back again next year or after two years when they need something from us. And yet whatever happens or transpires in the association, we are kept in the dark. So we need transparency in this thing. We need these people to come down the ground and lay structures. Kampala is very far from here. We want clear structures and proper structures and we want change of management because since this association was set up, 
they call it Uganda Musicians Association. It has spent a lot of years. It's only today we are hearing them come for us. Haven't we been musicians? We have been musicians for a very long time. Thank you. Okay. Hey, Uma meeting is not so satisfactory as far as I'm concerned because first and foremost, Uma has been existing for four good years and I've just got to know about it now. I didn't know that there was Uma and today is when we have been invited for a Uma meeting for the very first time in four years. So I don't know if really there is a good thing coming out of it. Oh yes, we'll talk about the meet today's, today's meet. Yeah, they have told us that Uma has been existing and disorganized because we've not been united countrywide. So today's meeting, they're telling us to register. We have registered, yes, so that the main executive from Kampala can be able to support us even from TESO region, meaning that we are supposed to form a circle as TESO circle of musicians that is going to be under the main body of WOMA which is in Kampala. They are telling us that finance support center, microfinance support, support center has promised 100 million which is going to enter the main circle account in Kampala before next week. We don't know even if we are really going to benefit from that money because we have just gotten to know about it today. We are yet to, to subscribe. But as Tesla artist, do you, uh, do you... I can say we have a, a registered circle under a Mionga. Yeah, that is, we, we organized that circle when this issue of the presidential initiative came in about Emiyonga. That is the circles I'm aware of right now. The Western Musician Circle and the Eastern Musician Circle from Soroti City. Yeah, we have those circles. So we are told that we are supposed to open yet another circle so that we can benefit from the Uma main circle. Now, what I would say is the meeting was good except it was unstructured. There was no proper agenda where information was brought in bits. We never exhausted information as we expected. Personally, I'd come here because I expected to see what is the Uganda Music Association supposed to do to bridge the gap that's between the Teso or Soroti music with uh, Kampala and see how we can expose this other hidden talent which is in this region to the other region. But that's, that's the main agenda why I came here early up to now. But uh, mostly people went and discussed about uh, Nyoga Association, such things. We deviated from the actual program. would love to learn how to, to fish other than the tapping only resources from government and so on. So,